Out of mounting frustration and tension today from community members, educators, and parents following a second public meeting held by the Texas Education Agency. KPRC 2's Brittany Jeffers has been monitoring the situation for us this morning with response from the meeting and what is planned for today. Brittany? Yeah, Lisa, a board meeting for the Houston ISD board members is underway right now. This morning I was at HISD headquarters where they were in closed session. But in reference to that meeting last night, it was supposed to answer questions about the HISD takeover. However, people who attended tell us that things quickly turned chaotic. And seven minutes after the deputy commissioner with the TEA started the community meeting, community members then took over. Parents and educators lined up from the crowd. They were using that megaphone to voice their concerns and attendees were supposed to send questions through their phones using a QR code or write them on note cards. The meeting was supposed to explain the TEA's process for hiring the new board of managers, which will oversee the process of improving students outcomes at Houston ISD. But parents say they still have many questions. I want to hear from Greg Abbott. I want to hear from all elected officials. I want to hear from Mike Morath and I want them to talk about have real conversations. The truth needs to be told by hearing both sides and the person from TEA did not get a chance to talk today and I hope that there will be a little bit more people following the formalities. Now, something important to note here, the TEA has two more community meetings scheduled for next week, the 29th and the 30th. In the meantime, however, we'll continue to monitor any developments from the HISD board meeting taking place today. In the newsroom, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News.